And we begin with exclusive new details about the Cardi B Nicki Minaj beatdown. What was supposed to be a star studded party for New York Fashion Week turned into an all out brawl after Cardi B attacked Nicki Minaj. But it was Cardi B who left the party looking worse for wear, barefoot with a huge bump over her eye, and yep, it's all caught on camera. <laughs> Cardi B lunges at rap rival Nicki Minaj during a party at New York Fashion Week. Don't do it. Don't do it. The 25-year-old new mom also throws her shoe at Nicki's head. Security guards separated the two rappers, but not before someone from Nicki's team stepped on Cardi B's red dress, ripping the seam and exposing her backside. A barefoot Cardi was escorted out of the party with a golf ball-sized bump over her left eye. The brawl broke out moments after Cardi B and Nicki Minaj stepped off the red carpet at the Harper's Bazaar Icons Bash. The beef between the two rap powerhouses has been brewing for years. Sources tell Daily Mail TV Nicki was jealous of Cardi's quick rise to fame and wanted to sabotage her career. The rappers seemingly made up in May when they were photographed smiling and chatting at the Met Gala. So what set Cardi B off? Apparently, Nikki liked an unflattering social media post about Cardi's parenting skills. After the incident, Cardi took to Instagram and posted a profanity-laden statement. When you mention my child, you choose to like comments about me as a mother, make comments about my abilities to take care of my daughter, all bets are bleeping off. Talk about an all-out war. Okay. And Alicia Corals joins me now. And Alicia, that is one explosive fight. So first question, how did she get the welt over her eye? So she could not get to Nicki Minaj. She was trying to fight her, couldn't get through her security. It was actually, actually sources tell me, a girl, Ra Ali, who Cardi was on Love & Hip Hop with, is the one that hit Cardi in the eye. She was part of Nicki's entourage, and she said, you're not going after my friend, and gave her that not in the head, Jess. Okay, so we also just saw her leaving the party, mm -hmm. no shoes on. How did she lose her shoes? Well, Jesse, she lost her shoes because she took them off. So Cardi <laughs> could not get through Nikki's security, all of her friends. At that point, she decided to take off her shoe. Not once, not twice, but three times. Somebody kept giving her shoe back. She kept trying to hit Nikki in the head with the shoe. Never connected, but Cardi does have a history of shoe throwing. She uh, actually threw a shoe in 2017 on Love & Hip Hop. Take a look. So what happened? All right, so she's a bit of a repeat offender. Uh, she, <laughs> well said, Jess, yeah, true story. It's incredible. This whole thing just sounds crazy, mm -hmm. and it sounds like it got pretty violent. It did. Charges filed at all? No charges have been filed. Um, NYPD says they didn't arrest anyone. Nikki does not plan to press charges. But I go to this event usually every year. It's a lot of fun, but Cardi was determined to fight Nikki. Uh, she didn't quite make that happen, and she left with no shoes. All right, well, no doubt this is not the end of the feud. As always, Alicia, thanks so much for being thanks, with Jess. us.